Okay, uh, can you briefly introduce yourself? Uh, my name's uh, Armando Wally. I'm a Texas House member from, from North Houston uh, and a good, good friend of Bill White. <laughs> What brings you down to Ed Couch today? Well, we're here at the Delta Region Revitalization uh, Facility here uh, to obviously support uh, what the good things that are being done here with the SBA, and obviously you want to thank Congressman Hinojosa for providing the funding and the resources for this facility to be here. And obviously the local elected officials, Representative Pena, uh, Senator Hinojosa, Senator Lucio, uh, for obviously be, being the catalyst for, for this community uh, but obviously we're, we're here to uh, encourage folks and the young people that are here uh, on these grounds uh, to engage them in, in the political process because without their help without their grassroots uh, efforts uh, our, our folks uh, such as or our candidates uh, such as Bill White uh, who's running for governor uh, will not have a chance. So we, we, we want to implore these young folks out here uh, to, to be involved, to stay active uh, in the political process. I'm Myself and a few others are, are young members of the Texas legislature. Uh, folks like uh, uh, Eddie Lucy III, uh, you have a good rep out here, Armando Martinez, Veronica Gonzalez, uh, other folks like that, Ryan Guillen, that we support uh, the Valley. And, and it's a partnership because you have to have um, you know, partnerships between folks in urban areas such as myself and Carol Alvarado from, from urban areas in Harris County and Houston. Uh, partner with our, our friends here in the Valley uh, and, and other, and particularly Coastal Bend and Laredo, pretty much all of South Texas, uh, so that we're on the same page and we want to help folks down here. But you have to have somebody in the governor's mansion that that is sensitive to the issues of South Texas, of the Rio Grande Valley, uh, and, and we're here to support that. Uh, I'm glad to be here. What's your experience with the, with, uh, the mayor? Well, the mayor uh, and I actually, uh, part of my district overlaps the city of Houston. I have unincorporated uh, parts of, of Harris County, which would be could be considered colonias, like here in, in, the, in the Rio Grande Valley. And, I, and the other part is, is overlaps within the city of Houston and city limits. So a lot of those issues, uh, street police protection, public safety, we, we worked hand in hand together and, and I was grateful to him and his staff for uh, allowing their, their staff to help a lot of our constituents, our mutual constituents. So uh, I know him well, he's a good man and he's going to do very well uh, as our next governor. Okay, well, I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs>